Hey, welcome back guys to the Minecraft Military Force and today we're going to be building a military shelter finally in Minecraft. So you can add this to your Minecraft military bases and here is what it looks like. So this is based on the Alaska XP military shelter which is rapidly deployable and it also is equipped with Alaska ECU which is an environmental control unit and it's used for heating and air conditioning. So if you're wondering what this box here in the back is for. And it also does have an interior, got a couple of beds here, although you can customize this uh, whatever you want to. Um, you can only sleep at nighttime or during thunderstorms. But yeah, here is what it looks like. It's a very nice design. And in the back, I actually have these windows covered. So if you guys do want to open the windows, uh, you guys just remove these trap doors here. And they would just look like that from the front. So yeah, I'm pretty glad that I finally am releasing a tutorial for the Minecraft military bases since we mostly just have vehicles, so I am very happy that this video is going out. So I moved it into this grass field so you guys can see a better contrast between it. And uh, yeah, let's get started. First off, we're gonna get some materials. Let's get a smooth sandstone, smooth sandstone slab, smooth sandstone stairs, a cut sandstone slab, a dark oak fence gate, dark oak trap door, um, levers, and what else? Um, let's say white concrete block for now. And we also want this polished blackstone button. All right, so first thing we do, uh, we're gonna make the front. So that's going to be um, four of these um, smooth sandstone blocks. So one, two, three, and four like that. And then we want to skip a block and add another four. So one, two, three, four like that. And then we're gonna go inside part, add in white concrete, and we're gonna make this 10 blocks long. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and then 10. Then we're gonna go diagonally from that, add in four of these smooth sandstone blocks. Same thing on the other side. So you got this nice H. Then we're gonna add in uh, side smooth sandstone slabs all the way across in the space between could do both sides. All right, then we'll add in this front wall. So that's going to be a smooth sandstone. It's gonna be three blocks wide, both sides like that. And then in the middle of this, we're gonna add smooth sandstone slab. And then we're gonna go um, to the other side. We'll do the same thing like that. And unlike the back part, this part is closed, so we're gonna use a cut sandstone, three blocks in the middle. Then smooth sandstone on top, three blocks wide. Like that. And we're gonna make this go all the way down around this doorway. And then we'll add um, the front part. That's going to be uh, three blocks tall, smooth sandstone here, so one, two, and three. Same thing on the other side, then we'll connect the top part together and we'll add in a cut sandstone slab right there. Cut sandstone slab on the sides of it like this. And we'll do the same thing on the other side, add in the cut sandstone slab above the other slab. Then we'll add in some dark oak buns, so one at the top in the middle, one in the middle of the door, and one in the corners. Other side, we'll do a similar thing, so one up here, one in the bottom corners. And this doorway is open, so we'll add in dark oak fence gates on either side of this, open it up. And dark oak fence gates inside here, open it up towards the outside. Then we'll go over here to this edge, add in smooth sandstone with a uh, smooth sandstone stairs. Then we'll add in a smooth sandstone slab up here. And we'll do the same thing on the other side, so add in smooth sandstone, and then smooth sandstone stairs and then a slab up here. And we'll do the same thing in the back, so smooth sandstone, stairs, and a slab. Smooth sandstone, stairs, and the slab. All right, very nice. Then we're gonna go ahead and add in uh, this cut sandstone and sandstone stairs. So right over here, we'll skip two blocks, add in two blocks tall, cut sandstone, and then the sandstone stairs. And let's skip two blocks here, do the same thing. 
like that. And then we're to go diagonally up and add in this cut sandstone slab. Like that. And then diagonally up from that, a cut sandstone slab. And we'll do the same thing over here. And we can actually make it um, three blocks wide like that. And we'll do the same thing on the other side. So just make these pillars like this. And make sure you're using sandstone stairs for this. Because you want a sort of like a different texture. So we got these nice ribs. Then we're going to connect the top part together using smooth sandstone uh, slabs. Make this go all the way across to the back. All right. Next thing we're going to do, we'll add in levers, and we're going to add it to sides of all these pillars and also the bottom parts, and then we're going to make them face each other. And these are supposed to be uh, the ropes that tie the tent down. And I barely have enough space on this side to fit it in. All right, so once we added that, it looks very nice. Then we'll move up to um, this back part. And we will add in uh, these birch trap doors and we'll close them up because these windows are closed like that. And then we'll add in <clears throat> the ECU unit. So take out sandstone wall, add in two blocks right here. We could actually delete that button. Then we'll make a two by two of cut sandstone. And on top, we'll add in a polished blackstone pressure plate, two blocks wide. Then we'll add in a ladder right here to the side and then two over here. And there is a sign, a birch sign with a black stained glass pane next to it. And I believe that's pretty much it for the ECU. Um, now we'll go back into the front area. We'll need to add in uh, this dark oak trap door. Right behind this window, I'm going to close it up so it's like um, a bit darker like that. And if you actually want to see inside, you know you don't even have to add in these windows. It is optional, but I think it does look a lot better if you're just closing it up like that. All right, so next thing we're to do, um, we're gonna fill in the walls and the floor. So the floor is actually very easy, it's just white concrete, just fill all that in. And the walls is easy as well, you just add in the smooth um, sandstone stairs and smooth sandstone and smooth sandstone slabs for the rest of these holes. All right, so once you added the floor and the walls, it should look like this. We'll go inside the tent and you can add whatever interior you want. For my interior, I just did a simple bed interior where people can sleep. So sleeping quarters, we'll just add in some beds in here. I'm gonna add in like six beds. I don't know how many beds you're supposed to put in here. Bouncy beds, very nice. Or you can add in whatever you want. Um, or you can even close the tent. If you want uh, the front to be closed, you just add in these cut sandstone uh, blocks and fill in this hole here. Uh, but yeah, that's pretty much it for the my first like Minecraft military force military shelter. I hope you guys enjoy this video. And if you do, remember to hit that like button down below. Subscribe if you want to see more. And I will see you guys in the next one.